I don't want to set the world on fire. Hello, this is Genosis with episode 4 of The Wasteland World on Fire. I've been working on the horde-based concept I have. It's going to be a very straightforward one, not relying on any pathing tricks and all that. It's really an elevated platform, the ditch, the spikes, and, you know, just dangerous stuff. to kill the zombies, keep them at bay, while I shoot them in the face, hopefully from a relatively safe distance. Well, that's the plan anyway. So I've been digging all night, and I think it's a pretty good uh, leeway done here. You know, it's pretty good. I'm going to dig it a lot deeper because I don't want them to have that much ability to get up to me. So I'm going to go just a little bit deeper here, that's what she said. So, uh, yeah, let's get it uh, cleaned up. I want to get the day started right away, getting, grinding the quests. I'd like to get a vehicle sooner than later, and I did not get a bicycle. I got parts, which didn't really help me a whole lot. And the uh, anvil here, well, the forge... He is not of much use to me without an anvil, and that's something we're missing. So either we need to find one, or I will need to get enough uh, books in order to allow me to uh, get it normally. Uh, let's move some stuff around here. Sunset, so that's pretty there. Fine. Pipes to fix that. Um, yeah, I think I'm good with that layout. Yeah. So yeah, let's hit the ground running. Uh, I don't have a quest yet, because I wasn't certain if I had completed... Oh, hi. Completed the tier or not. So I got the bike parts. And uh, depending on the mod, it doesn't always do that whole tier 1 complete business. So I don't know if I am complete tier 1 or not. But yeah, let's go find out. Oh, see you, chicken. See you, chicken. Gotcha. If I'm going to keep myself in me, because I'm actually pretty hungry right now. I don't suppose you have... If literally nothing, just um, mega crush, but that's not going to be much help. So job. Okay, so we're still in tier one. So we'll get whatever's closest. Clear zombies at Shade Tree Auto, which is pretty much perfect. I don't suppose you happen to have any food, do you, Bob? Some chicken soup and some sham. Guess that'll have to do for now. But yeah, I'll uh, take a look at that when I get back and keep a special eye out for uh, any sources of food. All right, arriving at Shade Tree Auto. This is tier one, so I am not expecting too, too much out of this place. Now, uh, in order to maximize loot, I'm going to see if I can grab the goods right there. I'm just going to grab that nice and quick and then get the quest started. All right, simple enough. Just to grab this nice and quick, uh, especially when it comes to vehicles. I do not want to skip any of these. So, uh, Handy land, claw hammer one, nice. Harvesting tools. You stay on the ground there, fella. So uh, also, it was brought to my attention that the pipe baton is considered a club. I think it says that here. Let me double check this. Uh, bum, ba -dum, like, still packs a decent punch. Ooh, not bad. So we got some polymer string mod, canopies. I will eat that immediately. But yeah, I think uh, it says it in the XML somewhere is about the pipe baton being a club, which is, you know, there's not actually a baton part of it. Like, no, there's no electricity. So that makes sense. Oh, I definitely want this. All right, working stiff with more harvesting tools. So stone tool, stone tools quality five and some calipers. I think I already have some. All right, I think that is all the stuff of any worth. Yeah, let's go get the quest starter for realsies. All right, that was a quick little double dip. Um, I generally will don't mind doing that so long as it doesn't take a good deal a long time. Like, if it took 15-20 minutes to clear the place, and then clear the place again, I probably won't do it for content's sake. But if I just step inside of a, you know, a building and just, whoa, oh, uh, cheese it nice and quick, then, uh, yeah, I don't mind. I'm, I'm here for the content. Alright, let's modify this bow. I can get the um, polymer strength on that be better and then we'll put the ergonomic grip on the baton so that is a good mix now it's probably going to be a feller right um um you're already dead right yeah okay 
So, oh, there you are. Hey, just one. E yeah. Oh, something up there, but uh, we'll grab this nice and quick. All right, which got for me? Uh, another vehicle Im uh, impact driver, which is fine. I don't mind having a surplus. I wonder if I can sneak if I get over here. No, try that again. Are you awake? No. Dang it. Thought oh, you're awake anyways. That's fine. <laughs> uh, that was uh, fine all the same. So we got a uh, pet of chest armor, miso, and a skull cap mod. Oh, we do have we don't have any chest armor, so that is perfect. I'll slop right on there. And I think that's uh, all I can do here. Oh. No, four grip doesn't go on that. That is fine. All right, get the last working stiff crate. And uh, more handy land and more calipers. So uh, that's precision workbench. I may as well sell one of those because I, I can only really use one. And I don't, I won't be getting the precision workbench for some time. I think it's pretty high level. So I uh, won't be seeing that anytime soon. All right, so the quest is complete. Oh, wait. Oh, is it? that's Brotherhood of Steel, or... Yeah, Brotherhood member. What's up, brother? I'm interested in hiring you. 10K. I don't have 10K. Ah, got a baseball bat. I would have preferred you with a gun, but uh, cool. I That's my first uh, Brotherhood of Steel member, and you look awesome. You keep being awesome, brother. No, actually, um, the Brotherhood of Steel insignia, because I've been a long time a fan of Fallout, you know, since 97, so we're looking at almost 30 years. And... Um, it's, uh, I almost got the Brotherhood of Steel insignia tattooed on my left shoulder. I have, um, a couple, actually I have a few different video game theme tattoos. I'm sure I've talked about it before. I have the uh, Legend of Zelda insignia off the shield on my right shoulder. I got the uh, Aperture Science tattoo on my left forearm. And I got a mix of the Empire and Republic logo on my right forearm, so... I, I, uh, I'm not completely symmetrical yet. I wanted to get that Brotherhood of Steel tattoo on my left shoulder. I even had the appointment once. Just uh, had to cancel it and then never got around to getting it back. And that was years ago. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to uh, maybe revisit that at some point. But then again, uh, I don't know. I'm getting on in the years. It's, uh, that kind of thing seems less and less appealing as I get older. But you never know. I might uh, work myself up to it. Oh, what is this? I don't remember seeing this kind of thing here. Oh my god, you get out of there. Whoa, <laughs> that's creepy. That is messed up right there. Um, I mean, I, I think I kind of want to see what's behind them. So uh, maybe it's creep, I clear out the creepy crawlers here. Oh, uh, that was pretty messed up. I don't think I can even, I can't even get under there. Yeah, so no, never mind. What's that here? Hold on. No, no, no. This was the place that I didn't do the garage twice. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, I'm glad I uh, came back for it. Forge head. Love that. We're at 16 out of 100. That's got a way to go. So um, we got wiring 101, some crap, and uh, some medicine, which won't be a bad thing. Here we go. So, Furious Fists and some meds. Oh, I am a little encumbered. Let's see if we can resolve that quick. All right, still a few encumbered, but that's not bad. We're almost home. All right, so knock that out nice and quick. What do you got for me? Not many thanks. So, let's see. Ammo could be a good thing. You know, I'm feeling ammo right now. Yeah, ammo. All right, so still tier one, I guess. Uh, fetch. Your zombies passing gas. No matter yeah. what. I'm breaking the do, I do for passing gas. Can I, can I get back here? Oh, we don't have any lockpicks. Um, oh, so you can get behind Bob here. So that's cool. I may have to uh, go grab some stuff later. All right, let's go home, empty out, and then uh, to do the other quest. I right, still can't do much food-wise, but uh, we're half food. So that's, uh, you know, it's been worse. All right, back off to the next quest. Hoping I finish that tier today. Feels like it's been dragging on, but the uh, the vehicle situation has not been helping that initiative. All right, we pretty much ended up next door to Shay Tree Auto, so I guess that works out just fine. Uh, you know what? I think the uh, the uh, loot is on the top of this, so I'm just gonna go grab that nice and quick. 
Oh yeah, that would be just a waste otherwise. All right, passing gas crate with more tools digest. 11, so iron tools. Well, that is good news. As soon as I get myself an anvil, then uh, maybe that'll be even better news. Oh wait, wait, the loot's actually over here. All right, so more forge head, love that. Then we got tech junkie, batons and, yeah, robots and stuff, batons degrade 20% lower. We have a pipe machine gun, which is just all kinds of awesome. And a car parts box with more tools digest and more salvaging for fun. Uh, cool. I call that a win. Let's just, uh, yeah, let's just skedaddle and get the quest started for real. All right, there we go. All right, let's, uh, smack things up and then loot afterward. It was not easy to convince myself to jump down here and get these guys, but they were not going to go anywhere otherwise. All right, there's still one thing. Oh, uh, of course you are. Okay. <laughs> I do not spare bullets when it comes to friggin' animals. All right, all that done. So back to the workbench. Uh, ooh, forged iron. Very nice. Uh, some bullets. A sniper book. Zooming uses less stamina. Okay. And another car parts box with vehicle adventures. Six out of 100. Yeah, that's uh, that's going to take a bit. All right, up on the roof yet again. We'll grab this. And uh, let's see, salvaging for fun and harvesting tools. Cool, cool, cool. All good stuff. It just, it's just going to take so long to get all those books. Oh, so place knock lockpicks. So I'm going to hit every place possible that could very well have what I'm looking for. All right, there you go. Inventory all cleaned up. So yeah, back to back to uh, Bob. Hopefully we got a tier complete. If the tier is complete and there's nothing s extremely interesting in the quest tiers, I'm just going to loot around whatever's in the in the area and uh, work on leveling and work on getting some stuff uh, gathered up for supplies rather than running around doing quests. All right, Bob. Yet another quest complete. You did it. So, job, let's see, man. crafting bundle, uh, magazine bundle, yeah, I think that's probably the best. Okay, yeah, still no tier completion, so what do we get? I have a day Am I gone? Funeral home. Some yeah, Godspeed. why not? Let's see what we'll get books we got. So, two handy lands, two southern farming. Oh, level up, nice. And more club crafting. All right, drop off and off to another quest. I mean, we're not going to have the quests. I just thought, sure, I would have tier one done already. But, uh... Yeah, it must be, uh, is there, like, no indicator to tell me when? No? All right, that's fine. All right, just looking at my points. I'm going to put a point in running around, because that seems to be all I'm doing right now. Uh, pack Mule uh, takes two points. So uh, I'll, uh, yeah, save up a point for that and do that. But I think the, uh, the running around the cardio seemed more important at the moment. All right, all cleaned up yet again. So, gosh, another quest. It's, uh, I think it's, is it 10 quests that gives you to tier two. That feels like it takes a long time, especially in the beginning. Oh, more pipe bombs. Check it. Oh, supply drop. Um, that way. Okay, that's near home. I'll have to grab that after I'm done. Oh, old semi. One out of eight. Um, yeah, I'm gonna leave that alone. It was uh, pointed out that vehicles can be found in various stages of disrepair. The, uh, if you can defend, find them a five at eight, six, uh, seven at eight at most, or even a whole complete vehicle ready to drive. And they say that, well, the commenter that brought this to my attention said that seven out of 10 is basically the holy, holy grail. Uh, ooh, hold on, four by four, two out of eight. I'm gonna go ahead and take this apart. All right, I thought I was gonna get some parts out of that, but I guess not. Uh, five out of eight, the old semi. This place is gonna be respawned anyway, so I may as well just take it apart. There we go. And a quick lesson in rapidly getting the uh, loot for this place. Just hop onto the roof. Is there usually a vulture here? I think there's a, a vulture in there. 
Okay, here we go. This place changed quite a bit from the last alpha. But uh, still roughly the same layout. Good stuff's on the roof. Just to kill a few uh, doorknobs here. What is with my stamina? Hold on. Yeah, there we go. Alright, let's grab the goods before we get started. Um, Bully mesh and some boots. Gun store box. Give me uh, something good. Explosives. Robotics parts. That's a good thing. And now I can make my own pipe bombs. Well, I've been having good good time with the pipe bombs lately, so uh, that is not a bad thing. All right, now that's complete. Get this place uh, restarted. All right, and let's uh, let's go clubbing at the funeral parlor. Bad satchel right here too. Perfect. All right, what do we win? Um, ugh. Not that great. Ooh, my almost broke off my pipe in that, in that fight. Ohm Depot, one of my favorite crates here. Uh, robotics for dummies and another tech junk that I already have. So I must be getting close to completion. I seem to be getting a lot of repeats of those. All right, so uh, <laughs> we still got some cleanup to do. I'm gonna double back and uh, do some looting and see if there's anything any of interest. Ooh, got some shades. I do already have the, the nerdy glasses I do. This adds perception. Yeah, I think I'll be staying, staying with the nerdy goggles or gl nerdy glasses. I don't know why I keep saying goggles. I've been doing that for uh, many playthroughs. Ooh, you know what? There was a bunch of books over here. So wiring, 14 out of 100. And pistol peat, 10% more damage with nine millimeters. Considering that's my uh, only gun, um, that's uh, not a bad thing. All right, place is cleaned out. Uh, let's see if I can do anything with this inventory. All right, spare everything I care to, so let's uh, get back, turn the quest in. And yeah, it looks like we're gonna go and grab that, um, what do you call it there? The supply drop, and hopefully we'll uh, get something good. I, I'm not sure what to expect from the supply drops in the mod. Uh, ideally, depending on the mod, they could be extremely generous. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping for the extremely generous side of things. I'm actually going to pop a uh, steroid. I got a lot of running to do, and I'm encumbered, so I may as well just uh, get some speed right here now. Oh, go. that's a raider. You know what? Can you run across the spikes for me? Ouch. Yeah, that hurts, Ow, doesn't it? That hurts. No. Doesn't it, though? Can you just, like, stay on the spot? Oh, you jerk. Son of a bitch. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> that tickles. Take this, you son of a bitch. Ooh. Ooh. It <laughs> tickles. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Oh, that actually really hurt. <laughs> um, damn it. Okay, you know what? Um, time to die. You son of a bitch. Okay. I let that seem personal. Nuclear material. All right. Oh. That guy's having a bad day. Why are there zombies in here today? All right, now with all that madness aside, it's got a quest turned in yet again. Many thanks. Uh, ooh, scope, bullets. Here's your pay. Yeah, I'm feeling bullets. All right, still uh, no completion. This is Dick's Diner. Well, right. oh, I want to dine at Dick's Diner. It's got the best dang, I don't know what the hell you, I can't think of anything that starts with B. That's food. Oh, there's a bit of a horde here. Don't mind if I do. Oh, oh, it's all the decapitations. I'm, I'm loving it. Um, you know what? Uh, with those points, that's good pack mule. That'll uh, help out in the uh, the uh, weight capacity department. Oh, there's a lot of puppers. Oh, oh my God. Whoa, whoa. You know what? Hey, hey, hey. Um, hey, guys, come here. 
Yeah, everyone, pile up if you don't mind. Just right there, like right there. Ooh. Okay, how are we doing down here? Oh, got a couple stragglers. Okay. Um, well, my place is on fire. Ah, dang it. Um, can I just fix that quick? Doink. All right, I don't think there's anything flammable there. I think it's just uh, residual fuel. So, uh, oh yeah, there we go, perfect. So yeah, that uh, definitely paid off. I'm getting tons of resources off this dog. 150 bones, we got 24 leather. Um, not a whole bunch of fat. I'm just uh, trying to get a, a good count going here. Just don't mind, skin, you jerk. Um, 170 bones. 183 bones. That's, uh, yeah, that's quite a bit. Yeah. All right, all taken care of. Let's uh, celebrate the sunset sarsaparilla. And I'm going to go grab that, uh, I'm going to go grab the supply drop before it gets too late. All right, there's the supply drop. And I'm definitely glad, ooh, there's a winter biome up here. I'm definitely glad I had the, uh, the buffs going uh, between the, the drugs and the sunset sarsaparilla for the stamina regen. Because, uh, yeah, this, uh, all that away. Oh. Oh, that's is that a feral cop? Okay. Um he's chasing a chicken. <laughs> okay, you guys are beating on the box, really? It's a race against time. Keep an eye on that cop, because once that chicken dies, um, I could be in trouble. Okay. Hopefully the box got some more health. Okay, cop's a little busy. Oh, he's coming for me. Oh. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, that's not good. Alright, uh, you. No, 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 Oh. Oh, well, that was a bunch of chaos. Wow. Nothing on him. It's a feral nurse. Okay, well, that was chaotic. Uh, would I get something good? The tools digest. Okay, iron tools too. Rad resistance. Uh, could use the bandage. Pipe pistol bundle. So that gives us a... Oh, pipe pistol from Fallout. So it's not like a the uh, vanilla pipe pistol. Hopefully it's better, because the other one? Pretty uh, pretty crappy. Then we got books. Knife guy. Okay. Forge ahead, up to 19. And tech planet, up to 12. So we can get a jury, be jury rig baton level 4. And that's about it. Okay. Not going to complain. Now, what does this shoot anyways? Let's uh, take this out here. So this is 9 mil, and it is worse in every single way. So, yeah, that's kind of <laughs> that's kind of pointless. Oh, what's going on there? Is that another... Looks like a, a Brotherhood dude? Let's do this. Okay, how you doing? Brotherhood member. Oh, you got a, a knife. Oh, you son of a bitch! There. Victory is mine! Well, I mean, victory is ours. There you go. What's up, brother? Um, 10,000 dukes. Yeah, still don't have the cash. Chicken! Chicken! It's my chicken. Ooh, two tech planets. Forget since I'm in an area... Ooh, rabbit! I'm in an area that I'm not usually in. Figure I'd take advantage to get some stuff while I'm here. But I definitely get that friggin' tier 1 stuff complete. What's this 4x4 four four rack? Yeah, I'll take that apart. And we got a uh, 4x4 seat. Ooh, art of mining. Mining tools do 10% more damage. Chicken! All right, here we go. Dick's Diner. All right. Um, four out of... Okay, I may as well take it apart. All right, we got the f Adam Sedan steering wheel. All right, you know what? I'm not going to... I don't have time, so I'm not going to double dip this one. Let's just rush it and get out of here as quick as we can. Oh, am I done? Uh, not quite. <laughs> um, did not expect this place to end that quick. Just, there wasn't even any doors. Just walk right in. Ow. Walk right in. And uh, here's the end loot. I mean, cool, I guess. Uh, great heist. Uh, turrets don't recognize you for three seconds. 
it's I think the single most useless skill in the game. And a sh ooh, pipe shotgun. Okay, that could be of some use to me. All right, looking for our last, uh, oh, is that you? You're our last zombie? Not quite. So yeah, this the layout of this place is so weird. All right, so uh, what are we missing? Oh, Dot is right there. Where'd you come from? <laughs> I know where you're going. Oh, you came from up there. Okay. And there's a zombie in the outside. I think? Outside? Or another part of the building. How do we get to where that zombie is? Um, do we go up somehow? Oh, maybe this. No? That? No? How do we... Uh... Oh, almost missed the ammo pile. How do we get to wherever that is? Oh, here we go. Unlocked. Oh, another bath. Oh, gotcha. Now we're done. I right, hear the crickets, so I think that makes it 7 p.m., which gives us three hours to get home. Turn the quest in. And I guess what I'll do is uh, another atom rack uh, is start looking at the uh, base design yet again. Oh, that uh, that car was uh, <laughs> holding the tree up. I'm just passing by this section here. That uh, well, apparently, over there, uh, there's supposedly a raider um, outpost down there, uh, or so say the comments, and I would need to be prepared. Uh, I'm not sure I would have everything I need between the guns. They also probably use up a lot of ammo. Not sure that would be smart with an impending horde night in a couple days. So, uh, we'll save that for when we have an excess or some really good weapons. Alright, Bob, please be done, Tier 1. Please, please, please. Uh, lucky Looter. Um, bullet. Well, I'm still leaning towards bullets. Uh, yeah, I guess 9 mil. Oh, finally. Oh, gosh. Um, I have to get the bicycle, but two water filters. Scrap laser pistol. Ooh, but no, I need the bicycle. I can't not take the bicycle. That sucks. Those other things sound great. But yeah, special jobs, uh, tier I've one. Just the task. Trader Gen. Awesome. Yes, this kind of and I'll leave all this for now. another day. We'll start with tier one tomorrow, tier two tomorrow, which is really exciting. So I'm glad we got that because I was starting to get worried. All right, now let's stop using my legs like a fool. Well, I mean, I'm still using my legs. Just uh, there we go. Look at this. Finally. All right, glad my hard work has paid off. It took four days to get through tier one. And I was uh, not cutting corners. I was blasting through those quests. I think I did like, yeah, three, four today. Just a lot. Here we get the short pot, short pipe shotgun. Looks like it does 90 damage per shot. Nine, uh, nine damage per pellet, 10 pellets. So yeah, that's uh, something I'm gonna have to hang on to. All right, so yeah, the uh, this is gonna be the next thing I'll be working on. I don't suppose I have, I have one point and I'm going to need two for more minor 69 or so. Maybe I'll, I will get that. But once I start putting down some blocks and start upgrading, I'm sure that'll uh, happen sooner than later. Ooh, actually I might be able to make a claw hammer. I just need two duct tape. So a claw hammer would be a lot better than using the uh, tools here. So claw hammer, there we go. Now if I'm not mistaken, I think it's also something you can put in the workbench. Um, that's usually Darkness Falls thing, but I think I've seen it as well for this mod. Ooh, claw hammer is done. Uh, I still need the axe, so let's get that here. So we have a better repair tool. Oh yeah, two hits for upgrade. So if I can get a lot of upgrading done tonight, I should get another level, which will help with the digging once I get a more uh, minor 69er. Now, looking at the points, I almost regret my placement. I would have loved to have living off the land and mother load. And maybe even some archery. Alas, I don't have much control of it. And I think working with those limitations uh, makes the, uh, I guess, the mod shine in some ways. Forces you to alter your playstyle a little bit. Alright, out of wood. I gotta start going, uh, topping some trees tonight. And yeah, that level's gonna happen fast the way the experience is moving. So, uh, yeah, this is my plan for tonight. We're gathering resources, cranking away at this, hor this horror base design. Uh, probably digging the trench a little bit deeper and then maybe doing some sort of a flooring on it. Uh, eventually, I like to get some uh, electrical wiring at the bottom 
So when they're uh, wailing at the base of it, they will be shocked, which will reduce how much damage it's taking. So that is my plan anyways. I doubt I'll be getting that for day one, for you know my first horde, but definitely gonna aim for the second horde. I'm just gonna need a lot of electronics uh, boxes and all that stuff, so. Just a lot of books. That's our, that's our plan, just so many books. This has been Genesis episode four of The Wasteland World on Fire. Like we saw here today, like the video. I'd like to see some more in the future. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Catch us tomorrow where we finally get some wheels and get shaken and moving on tier two quests and I continue getting prepared for our first horde, which will be interesting because I did cap out the settings at 64 zombies, so <laughs> I don't know what to expect. Stay tuned.